since I was four or five years old or so, I wanted to be an astronomer. I had read Highlights Magazine in the elementary school, so they still have, I think. Um, I'd read the articles in space and astronomy, and that just blew my mind. And remember, this is also the space age I was growing up in, too. So there was a, a cultural focus in our society. As an undergrad, a class I took, there were five of us in that class, and we're all astronomers now. My name is Don Winget, and I'm a professor of astronomy here. I'm the Harlan J. Smith Centennial Professor of Astronomy, and I'm also fortunate to be uh, a university distinguished teaching professor. The qualities that, that make successful scientists are the same in astronomy as they are in any field. You know, this is University of Texas, so most of the students we get here actually are pretty bright. You have to be not just bright, but able to focus and motivate it. You have to burn inside to know something about the universe nobody's ever known before. In the end, the only way to find out if you really want to spend your life doing scientific research is to do scientific research. Surprise! It's not to take classes, it's not to uh, you know, be a whiz at standardized tests or anything like that. You get people that think that they can't do math or science and that's why they're not engineering or science majors. And to discover that maybe they really can and they just had some bad teachers in their past to sneak up on them and overcome their math anxieties, you know, and, and uh, let them realize that this is stuff that they can understand and even contribute to. So that's a lot of fun. I, I just, I really enjoy teaching.